Hey, no offense. All right. Boy, oh boy. Rub-a-dub-dub, thanks for the grub. You know that's not how we do things, Manny. But I'm starved. We must say grace first. Grace, grace, feed your face. Sunny boy, no. Proper grace. Proper grace, grub in my mouth space. Sunny boy, that's not right. Don't tease Mammy. Don't tease me. Her name's Mammy, mine's Manny. And I'm Sunny boy. Lord, I'd like to thank you for the names you've given us, which not only rock, but also roll. Roll right off the tongues of anyone awesome enough to know that they not only suit us, but describe who we are as people, as well as to each other. He's my son, Sonny Boy. I'm a man, Manny. And she's the mother, Mammy. I suggested Daddy's name be Fothbird. Now, now. I like the name Manny just fine. Manny, Mammy, and Sonny Boy. Our signatures are incredibly similar. <laughs> They question us all the time when we write checks. And thank you, O oh Lord of the Flies, for not visiting us with your fly underlings to ruin the food we're about to shove into our face openings. And I say face openings because Sunny Boy here likes to snort his corn. It's like a game, O oh Lord, and I usually win. Or go to the hospital. Sometimes both. Black Friday usually sorts it out. Fisticuffs over cheap merch can do wonders for a clogged nostril. <laughs> or elbow cuffs to the back of the head. Pops that chunk right out. Yes. Oh, Lord of the Rings, thank you for giving us Americans our Thanksgiving in November, a month otherwise used as padding between the behemoths of commercialism known as Halloween and Christmas, and for not making us Canadians, who have their Thanksgiving a few weeks before Halloween, because let's face it, it's too damn cold in Canada to be eating all that stuffing in November. They're hibernating by November, I think. All them French lumberjacks are basically bears. What's a Canadian, Pops? I have no idea, son. I'm American. Speaking of, thank you, gracious God of a singular nature, for the pilgrims that came to rape and ravage this land and its indigenous peoples, who they themselves traveled here along the land bridge of ice and dirt in Alaska tens of thousands of years ago. Those very same pilgrims who founded this nation of bigotry and shame that lays waste to its own contradictory ideals every chance it gets. Immigration's a bitch, and our nation seems to think that it can decide when it's done taking in foreigners. Those blankets weren't the only things diseased. I'm hungry! Thank you, the great Godsby, the American classic, for allowing us bodies that tell us when we need to eat by using stomach pains. Yeah, seriously. And oh lords of plenty, not to be confused with Lardo, a name that I call myself after I overeat during one of the many holidays revolving around an abnormally large male that's way bigger and more complicated than a family of four has any reason to prepare for themselves. Thank you, Lord, for that insanely long run-on sentence that wasn't even properly structured. I had a thought, but I lost it. Probably a good thing. Thank you, old lordy lordship of lord and lord sauce for giving me crappy memories so I get lost in my own pointless ramblings, cutting them shorter and allowing me to get back to thanking you for trivial things that don't matter. On this holiday about starving pioneers running from one bad country to make a new one somewhere else. All right, that's enough thinking. Let's eat, sonny boy. Oh, they passed out from hunger pains. Oh well, more for me. Huh, you know this kind of tastes more like uh, pork than it does turkey. Hmm. Kind of a funny looking bird too. Oh.